While it can be uncomfortable, I do wear my smartwatch to sleep so that I can keep track of my sleeping patterns and also my heart rate while sleeping, but there's a much better, more comfortable way to monitor that data, and that's with the RingCon Smart Ring. The RingCon Smart Ring is a titanium ring that uses a PPG low-powered chip. It can accurately track vitals like your heart rate, your blood oxygen saturation, even your skin temperature. We're gonna take a full in-depth look at the RingCon Smart Ring. Big shout outs to RingCon for sponsoring this video. Let's go ahead and get started. So RingCon sent out this sizing kit. So you actually are gonna get to try out all the different sizes. They recommend that you wear the ring for at least a day, uh, the sizing ring that is for at least a day so that you're sure that you have the correct size. And then there's also the actual colors to choose from, uh, from the ring. I think I'm either a 10 or 11, but my right hand obviously is a little bit bigger than my left hand, so that seems to slide on pretty easily. I will wear this for an entire day and make sure. I do like that they send out this kit first though and let you test out the sizes rather than potentially sending you a ring that doesn't actually fit. The RingCon Smart Ring has arrived, so I'm gonna go ahead and take it out of the box and we'll get this set up. All right, we've got a little card up top. There is the ring. I'm gonna go ahead and take that out and set it to the side. We've got a quick guide and our manual with instructions. And here we have our charging case. And it looks like there's a couple of little pins down here at the bottom and they just line up with these pins on the ring and you can just stick that there and it will charge. This does have a USB-C port for charging the case itself. You get seven days of battery life with just the ring or 150 days of battery life with the ring and the charge case, which I think is pretty stout. That's much better battery life than other devices that track the same stats like a smartwatch or other wearables. Next up, let's go ahead and get this set up. It should be super simple. You're gonna download the application, go ahead and get registered and connect the ring. All we have to do here is put the ring in the case and it should begin to blink blue. All right, once it's blinking blue on this little light in the front, we're gonna go ahead and start the search. It's already found the ring, so I'll go ahead and select that and now it is pairing. Okay, just like that, it is paired successfully and I would go ahead and give it the update if it does ask for the update. All right, now that we're all connected, I'm gonna go ahead and put the ring on my finger and I'll get back to you guys here in about a week or so with my thoughts. So for me, the number one reason why I would use this over this is the fact that it is just so small and lightweight and comfortable to wear. I can easily wear this 24 hours a day. It does have water resistance, an IP68 water resistance rating, so I can wash my hands with this on, I can hop in the shower or even go swimming. It's so much easier to wear the RingCon to bed than a smartwatch. The smartwatch is really bulky. If I put my hand under my head, it's hard and uncomfortable. Um, it also lights up, so if I accidentally flip my wrist, the screen's gonna light up. That has woken me up in the past. You don't have that with the RingCon. There are a few lights incorporated with the sensor, but you're not gonna really be able to see those while you sleep in the same way that you would on your smartwatch. So less interruptions while sleeping, way more comfortable to wear the ring to bed than the smartwatch. And that's why I prefer it when monitoring my sleep patterns. Not only does this give you vitals like your heart rate and your blood oxygen saturation while sleeping, it can also tell you the amount of sleep you had and the amount of time you had in different sleep stages like REM sleep, deep sleep, and even light sleep. You also have the ability to add naps within the application. So if you have a nap from 15 minutes to three hours, you can also add that into your tracking. Sleep tracking is of course very important, but the RingCon Smart Ring also tracks you throughout the entire day. So you get 24 seven monitoring with this ring. This is going to help you to monitor your stress levels throughout the day. At the end of the day, you get an entire graph so you can perceive your actual stress level. This also gives you information on your steps for the day, your calories burned, and the intensity of your activity throughout the day. I do love the fact that this gives 24 hours of monitoring. It's so comfortable that I'm not gonna take it off. In the same way that I wouldn't take off my wedding band, I wear this 24 hours a day. The smartwatch, not so much. I do take it off throughout the day. If there's anywhere where I think I might get this damaged, 
uh, working outside or otherwise, I would take this off. A lot of folks don't like to sleep with this on, so you would take it off, or maybe you would take off your smartwatch before getting into the shower. The only reason you would need to take off the smart ring is to charge it in the case every five to seven days. Otherwise, you get 24 seven monitoring out of the smart ring. As mentioned, I've been able to achieve about five to seven days of battery life with the ring on a single charge and the charge case can charge this ring fully 15 to 18 times. The other thing that I really like about the RingCon smart ring is there's no subscription required. So you're gonna be able to access the application and all of your data for free without having to pay an additional subscription fee. I think that's definitely an incredible value. In the end, the RingCon Smart Ring can do pretty much everything that I need it to do when it comes to tracking my vitals and activity and even my sleep just as much as my smartwatch can do. The only thing that it can't do is give me my phone's notifications and of course, tell me the time. The RingCon Smart Ring is definitely gonna be my go-to device when monitoring my sleep activity. It's so much more comfortable to wear in bed than at my smartwatch and overall, I think this is gonna be the best option for tracking all of my activity and vitals. I'll be sure to include a link of where you can find out more information on the RingCon Smart Ring and where you can purchase one for yourself. That about wraps it up for this video. Thanks guys for watching, be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.